Rain returns. Your forecast is coming up. A Drexel man who went missing just over two weeks ago was found dead as the result of a car accident that was discovered last Thursday. The body of 72-year-old Charles Brady was discovered in his car that apparently had left the road on 18 Highway and landed in a creek. A passerby saw the car and notified authorities. Around 2.30 Sunday morning, the Butler Fire Department was called to 407 West Ohio Street to find a house about 60% involved in fire. The Adrian Fire Department was also called to assist. It turns out the house was not occupied and the exact cause is unknown. Crews were on the scene until just after 6 a.m. The park in Rich Hill was filled for a big concert Friday night. Country superstar Joe Diffie entertained an enthusiastic crowd for just under two hours with a mix of new, classic, and original country music. No word yet on who will be headlining next year in Rich Hill. Ramona Snyder was honored by the Bates County Memorial Hospital for her many years of service in the records department and medical transcription. Retirement means she'll get to spend more time with family and friends along with volunteering as well. And after 33 years of service, Martha Stockloffer was also honored in a retirement service at Bates County Memorial Hospital. Martha served as a nursing assistant and later moved into the surgery department. She'll now have more time to enjoy quilting, mud runs, and plans to devote more time to cancer fundraisers. Well, we really need an extended break from the rain, but we're just not going to get it. There's a 30% chance today, 90% chance tomorrow, and a 50% chance on Wednesday. After a high today of 91, we're expecting 73 tomorrow and around 80 on Wednesday. That's your news for now from MidAmerica Live.